Hello everybody, what's going on? It's Firelight 457 and welcome to s system test number 32 of the Potter PFC 4064 system. So anyways, let's get started. <laughs> The system test was requested by the AOL guy, so we're going to go ahead and go over what devices that he requested. Down here for zone 1, he requested the Simplex 2999-9756. And then coming up here for zone 2, he requested the Simplex 2099-9101. Then coming over here beside the door he didn't request anything but i just have my simplex 4099 9001 which we will not which i will be pulling first today and come over here in that one he requested the gentex commander 3 set on code 3 horn high volume strobes on 15 candela and it's on Gentex Sync, so this will be doing audible silence. Then coming over here, NAC2, he requested the Simplex 4903-9215 electromechanical horn strobe. This is on 30 Candela, and the system will be doing continuous. And come down over here and got the fit system sensor 5602, which we will be testing today in walk test mode. Then I got the system sensor 21151, the system sensor I3, which we will not be testing those two today, and we will also not be doing the key switch today either. And then coming down over here, I got the Edwards 278A REL, which is connected to the CO system, which we will be pulling today. All right. With all that said and done, we're going to go ahead and start with the test. And now, before I start with the test, again, please do not pull fire alarms in real buildings or tamper with any life safety equipment out in public. Or not be responsible for your actions if you choose to do so. And please do not watch if you have epilepsy to flashing strobes or lights. So what I'm going to do first is I'm going to activate the system like normal with all three of the pull stations. And then after that, I'm going to put the system into walk test, and we're going to key activate all the pull stations and test the 5602 with the hair dryer. So, with all that said and done, we're going to go ahead and start by pulling the Simplex 2999-9756. Here we go in 5, 4, 3, 2, 1. See, we got audible silence on the Commander 3. And we're going to go ahead and re-alarm with the 2999 I'm oh, sorry. Yeah, Simplex 2999-9101. Here we go. In 5, 4, 3, 2, 1.
I'm just going to go ahead and reset these pull stations. All right, now we're going to go into the main control panel. We're just going to hit system reset. Now that the system's reset, we're going to come over here and we're going to go ahead and pull the 4099-9001. Here we go in 5, 4, 3, 2, 1. I decided to silence the system with the enunciator this time, and we are also going to reset from it as well. All right, system's now reset. Now I'm just, I'm gonna go ahead and put the system into walk test, and I'll get back with you shortly. All right, I have the panel, I now have the system in walk test. Now we're gonna go ahead and key activate all the pull stations. So the alarms will just sound for just a few seconds and then they'll turn right back off, just like a normal walk test would do. So here we go. We're just going to come over here and we're going to do the so much 499 All right. Now I'm just going to take my hair dryer. We're going to go ahead and activate the heat detector. So here we go in five, four, three, two, one. I do apologize that the simplex horn strobe sounds a little bit rattly because I have it tightened to the bat box a little bit. But I do apologize. All right. Now we're just going to come over here and we're going to go ahead and end the walk test. Alright, now we are at a walk test. And before I end the video, I'm going to come over here. We're going to pull the yellow pull station for the CO system. So, 
And here we go. In five, four, three, two, one. Now I'm just going to go ahead and take my Cat 45 key. Just going to insert it like this. going to go into the main control panel and we're going to hit system reset. All right, this is going to do it for system test 32 of the Potter PFC 4064 system everybody. Special shout out to the AOL guy for requesting this system test. And be sure to check them out. And, and if you'd like to request a system test, the description of what to do will be in the description in this video. Plus, I also have it in the description in my collection video of how to request a system test on the 4064 system or the 9600 system. So, feel free to do so. And also be sure to check out my other fire alarm videos. I have tons of content out there that you do not want to miss. Hit that like button and I will see you next time. See you later, everybody.